Hi, I'm Mike Kudrowski. We're out here at Piru, California, MX Track, and we're doing the 2012 CRF 250 intro with Honda. And uh, I'm going to go out and take a few laps on it and uh, see what it's all about. There's some changes from last year, from 2011. So uh, we're going to go out and do some riding, and I'll tell you about how it feels. Hey, we're back. I uh, just got finished riding the bike, and uh, man, the bike is awesome. It has a lot of good bottom end, mid power. Um, some of the turns I'd come into, if I was revving in second, it was a little bit too much. If I shifted to third, it seemed like it pulled third throughout the turn and down the straightaway. So it was kind of unique for a 250F. Usually you got to keep it in that one gear coming out of the turn, and this seemed to pull second and third. Um, also, the suspension on it, um, I really noticed the suspension was really progressive. It was plenty stiff for me, and I'm, I'm about 185, 87 now, and uh, it was plenty stiff for me, hitting the jumps hard, landing, if I flat landed some of them, felt really good. And also during braking, when I transitioned to a lot of front brake coming down a hill, the bike really seemed to stay flat. It didn't really nosedive in the front a bunch when I got on the front brake. Um, like I said, the power is good, the tires, uh, they come now with the MX-51 Dunlaps, the tires hooked up really good, especially here at this track, it's kind of someplace muddy, tacky, and also blue grooved, um, seemed to hook up pretty good. But uh, overall, I thought the bike was really good, I was really happy with it, and um, you should go out to your Honda dealers and, and see it at the dealerships and try to get a ride on one.